I have been challenged by my husband since I lost the last game of recognizing our cats and he is a photographer. He thought it would be funny to take some photos of our cats and I would have to be able to recognize our cats. So I will probably fail miserably at this again and he will laugh. Let's begin. Doubting yourself so hard. I am doubting myself so hard. Oh dear God. <laughs> Well, it's a black nose. Now the problem is we have multiple black noses. <laughs> hmm. It's a pretty shiny nose, so I'm going to say Alice. Ding, ding, ding. Yes. Okay. This looks like it could be a paw. It's definitely a tortoise shell, but now we have two of those. So is it Lulu or is it Kip Kip? Now, Kebby does have one light paw, but I think Kebby's paw is more golden than creamish. So I'm going to say. Oh, is it Baba? There's long hairs in there. Oh my god, I'm doubting everything. <laughs> um, I'm going to go with my gut and say Luna. Are you sure? Oh no! Try number two. Rio? See, I saw the long hair, but what part of that is him? Like, what? It is his foot? Is his foot that light? Huh. The long hair, that's why I got thrown when I saw it. But it kind of looks like it has Lulu's colors. It does. It's only gonna get harder. That's Kebby. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> that's black with some golden flecks. That's Kebby. That is Kebby. Whiskers. This one should be fairly obvious. <laughs> White whiskers on a black cat is Momo. Yes. Not on a black cat, on a black nose. More whiskers? Ears? An ear. <laughs> ear hair. <laughs> this one is a bit of a wild card because there's a bit of trickery in the photo. But let's see what you come up with. It's a dark cat by the look of it. And it has white hairs in its ear. Now does Alice have white hairs in her ear? I don't think so. Alice is pretty black, right? Does Momo have white hairs? He has white whiskers, so does he have white hairs in his ears? I can't even picture my cats anymore. The top of the ear, like the top right corner of this picture definitely looks like Alice, but I feel like it can't be Alice. And at the bottom there is a little bit of lightness, which would speak for Momo. That's why I say it's a real trick, so it is Alice, because the light is so bright on her. Yeah, that makes it. Alice, where are you? Do you have white? No, that's what I'm saying. It looks white because it's just blown So out. then, that is photography mistake. I will not take responsibility for this. Plus, the bottom here looks like Momo. Look, there's a bit of brightness down there. Again, it's the light. He's tricking me, guys. This is not a fair game. Oh, dear goodness. That's just fur. That kind of looks like a hedgehog. Do we have one of those? That should be your biggest clue. <laughs> What, that it looks like a hedgehog? Mm -hmm. Which one of my animals looks like a hedgehog? Whose fur looks a bit like hedgehog spike curls. If you look very carefully at her fur, I'll give you a tip there. Okay, so it's a female. Is there a bit of ginger at the bottom there? And a bit of white at the top there? Is it Maya? Is that your final answer? That is my final answer. It is Maya. Yes! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> A white posy. A cream posy. Okay. It's not white. It definitely has dark spots. It's not mine. Now, that leaves Kebby and Luna. Both of them have a single cream paw. Now, is that more gray or is it more brown? And also, is Kebby. Kebby has a back foot that's light, isn't it? That looks like a front foot. So I'm going to say Luna. It is Luna. Yes! My logic! How many of these are there? I'm on number nine now, I think. I'm on number eight, number eight. Okay, another tortie. You went mad on the torties. Because it's the only way to confuse you. Oh, is it, it could even be Maya, technically speaking, depending what angle you take on. Hmm. This looks too dark to be Luna, so I'm gonna say Kebby. It is Kebby. You're quite good at this. Faring better than I thought. 
This is Ryu for sure. They have long hair. Thank <laughs> thankfully Ryu has long hair. This looks like it could be human, therefore it's <laughs> it's Baba. Also, there's no guarantee of the amount, same amount of cats photos, just so you know. Okay. Also, we we have 13 of them. You're on okay. 10 now. I'm on number 10 now. This is very fluffy. And it's light. And I do feel like it's grey, so I think this could be Ryu again and this could be his tail. It's not. I think number two. Okay, now I'm Who feeling else is great. Yeah, okay, but what part of that is of her? Yeah, you can't ask me that, I can't remember what parts. Okay, so it's Luna. Yes. But I think it's literally just like a side of a fur with a little gender. That really looks, it's, it's quite quite long haired looking. Mm -hmm. It kind of looks like it could be Baba's tail, but because the underneath of his tail is very bright. 11. Again, we have that quill look. But also it can have, has the Siamese creaminess to it. But Maya does have some ginger and some whites. Those are the two I'm leaning towards. There's dark skin. Why does, does Mom have dark skin? Dark skin. Right at the top there and there, it looks pretty dark. Does Mom have quilts? Quilts. Yeah, okay, but <laughs> quill looking hair. But that again could just be like that, couldn't it? And I know I've admired the topness of his hair before, interior designer, right there. If I could color match my house to Momo's, the interior of Momo's fur. But is that the interior of Momo's fur? I'm going to say Momo. It's Maya, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's is Maya. Okay. okay, so Maya has quills. I doubt everything. No, nothing. This is an ear. I think. It is an ear. I will give you that. Well, I mean, there's a tip. What else would it be? Who has dark ears? It's too. There's too much brown for it to be Alice. I think. It hasn't been there's a no. There's no play on light in this one. That's actually the skin color and the hair color and hair color and stuff. Okay, so I don't think it's Alice because I don't think Alice has such bright hairs. Um, there's very little Alice in this. Um, that leaves Kebby or Momo, because Baba would have tufts on the tip of that ear, and Maya has ginger ears, I think. Can't even picture my cats anymore, I don't even know what color Maya's ears are. Where is she? Is it Moomer? It's Moomer. It is Moomer. So for fun facts, there was two of each, this one is a... Bonus round. Oh, the quills! But I feel like, did you put that much Maya in there? Is Maya that fascinating to photograph? Again, there's two of each. This is one extra. So who's the extra card? Do I look like I've counted how many I've had of each? No, but this is the last one, so we've had two of each. Ah. Oh. He's in the shop now, guys. Look at his beautiful, beautiful fur. Hey, Baba! Baba? Why am I calling you Baba? Yeah, right up mainstream. Street stream. Yeah, so who is it? For the win. For the win. So if I get this right, I win the entire game, even though I got win. some wrong. You have four wrong for now. For the win. Hi, baby. Hi. You want to come on my lap? Who do you think this is, boy? Ryu. Try again. So do you have ginger in him? There's ginger in there? Well, what's that? I don't know, he's a bit brownish. It's not Ryu. This looks tabby colored to me. It's not Ryu. <sighs> well, the quills tell me it's Maya, but I feel like that would be too obvious. And Kami has a bit of ginger. There's gold. It is Maya. He clearly has a thing for his own cat because Maya was prominent in this game. And I feel like a failure now. I mean, at least I got over half right. Yeah. Four wrong, four, four wrong out of 13. Now guys, we need a game that we can wait, play wait. where he has to be in it, and I don't. First, we also want to challenge the audience. <gasps> we want to challenge the audience? I'm going to put the photos with their eyes on, and we must see if they know who to do it. Are we leaving this in the way it is now? Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Okay, so then first we're going to challenge the audience. We're going to post pictures of the eyes, and you must tell us in order which eyes belong to you. 
and obviously some will be very easy, others might be a little bit more difficult. Also, if you have any ideas of games that we could play, maybe some where the photographer can actually be involved, that would be great. And put it in the comments below, give us a like and please share with all of your friends so that we can keep going and um, keep growing this channel. And that's it for us today. Bye!